Hey, yo, what up, what up, what up, though? What up, good folks? I said, what up, good people? I'm a little hype right now. So an hour before I was supposed to get off work, GameStop called, and it was like, hey, sir, uh, we finally got your Batman one of one cowlins. I said, you do? <laughs> you do? <laughs> Bro, y'all don't even understand. Y'all don't understand how much I was bugging these people. I would come in week after week, day after day. Is it in yet? Is it in yet? Because, you know, stopping home, whatever like that. Uh, stop at a few stores uh, before I had to pick up my little girl or whatever. And GameStop was on the list. You know what I mean? <clears throat> and I was getting a little peeved because I seen other folks online on YouTube's <laughs> reviewing it. I'm like, okay, uh, what's up with my GameStop? Why my GameStop lagging it? Nonetheless, I'm about to go in there. I don't know if y'all can see GameStop in the back or not, but it's back there. And I'm about to see this glorious one of one Batman cow. Like I said, I ordered it two months ago. I ain't gonna talk too much about it, but uh, Go Commanders, I still got the Redskin logo. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Hey, I'm super proud of my team and how we handled that situation with, with the Bears. Are you Chicago Chicagoans? I, I, I don't know how y'all say it. <laughs> hey, that was just great fortune on our part, bad fortune on y'all part. Honestly, we shouldn't have got called for that pass interference. It was a pass interference, but homeboy had no reason to do that. That ball was going to be overthrown to the back of the end zone. He got nervous, grabbed him around his waist. All my football fans know, know what I'm talking about. If you're not a football fan, I'm sorry. It's going over your head. We're going to get to this cow right now. But six and two, we rolling, baby. Next, bring on the Steelers. All my subs that Steelers drop down in the comments. Talk trash if you need to. Bring on them Steelers, baby. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, here we go, guys. So, man, this thing is so massive. And excuse the mess. I know everybody's looking at my shelves like, damn, so we finally get to see the full wall. <clears throat> Not really, because it's not really set up right. You know, Marvel is a mess. DC's things done fell over, missing gaps because figs fell. Anyway, beside the point, this is none other than the DC Direct one of one scale collector cow Batman 1989. Super pumped, super, super hyped. I'm out of breath because I had to move a whole bunch of things around on the table. This table is usually a mess. Uh, it's cool because it kind of helped me clean up a bit. That's that's beside the point. <clears throat> I can barely talk. I'm so excited. Okay, here we go. Hey, look, listen, real quick. I know there's a bunch of big Batman fans out there, big DC fans in general, like, but just know, if you have a one of one scale cow, Batman, you pretty much in cement as a big Batman fan. Like you're cemented. You feel me? There's other things you need to have too, but we'll talk about that on a later date. Anyway, let's open this box and see what this thing really looks like. All right, so cut it open here. And it has the McFarlane's Toy Store sticker, you know, on it for the seal. So you know it's official, like a bristle. Man, got a little, little cardboard on there. Man, okay, um, how we gonna do this? So what we'll do, we'll turn it upside down. That's how we'll do it. Turn it upside down, plop it out. Easy. Whoa, here we go. There we go. Put that here. Ooh, wee. That thing is 
massive. So let's flip it so you guys can see the box, right? So you got Batman on this side. You got Batman uh, cow showing on this side and then Batman emblem right here. Boom. Product shot again. Same thing as the other side. Bottom, not much. All right, all right, all right, all right. We in there like swimwear, baby. Okay, let's take this thing out. Cut the tape on the back, you feel me? Buddy, let me tell you, I'm excited. I know a lot of people are like, where is he going to put that thing? Don't worry about that. I got plans. I got plans. Plans, I tell you, plans. All right. Let's open this thing up. Whoa, first thing you see, ears. You see the ears sticking out. First thing, nothing but ears. Oh, the plastic came out with it. Holy smokes. Man. show y'all what I'm seeing. If y'all can see it, if you can't, you can't. But that is, that is the cow. So when I pull it out, it's going to be facing y'all. Pause. Look at that. Look at that bad boy right there. Wow. Wow, look at that. So, it's like a uh, hard plastic, um, man. So it's like, you cannot, I got a little scrape right here on mine's. Oh, it looks like it's just extra flash molding or whatever, but you cannot actually like put this on and wear it because there is no hole at the bottom. I mean, and plus it's hard plastic. You see what I'm saying? So it's like, it's for display purposes only. But, let's see, it comes with a base as well. It comes with a base. That was at the bottom of the box, the base. So, let's take this stuff off. Let's see if we can, because right now it's just leaning on its own. But the base is at the bottom plastic here and I think that's it okay, that is it man look at that okay so some assembly required for this base right and it does come with instructions, which is good. So everything is in plastic, everything like that. Take this off, and it's showing you the instructions here. And it's just one page, one, one page, no back page, just one page of instructions. And looks simple enough. So we're going to do that right now. Like, we ain't cutting nothing. This is this is how it's happening. You know, if it was live, it would be going down just like this. So, let's see. A uh, small piece in like this. Snaps in pretty good. Oh, sorry you guys can't see this. Like, it's very difficult to show, right? Um, but that piece just snaps in like this. Um, and then this piece also snaps in like that. And this is the front of the actual base. It has Batman 1989. You guys can see that. So they're supposed to fit within the grooves of the actual cow. So if you guys can see the top, how that is there. And then the, the bottom inside of the cow resembles that. 
So we're just going to line it up, put it up in there like this. Wow, trying to do this by yourself. But it snaps in there pretty good. And it looks like it's like floating, right? But I'm going to bring it closer so you guys can actually get a look at it. Give it like a little, man, this box that, that it came in is super in my way. But we're going to get as close as we can. Look at that bad boy. <laughs> That's clean. Look at this. Look at this. See if I can get it closer. Ears. All right. Rotate it around. It's the side profile right there. This thing is crazy, crazy, crazy. That's the back. Here's the other side profile, right? Where if I can if I can see? Can you see? Can you see my face? Yeah. Do I look like Batman? <laughs> this is dope, man. I'm geek, guys. I am super geek. This is this is super sick, man. But uh, it ain't really much to show, right? Uh, the emblem is the 1989 emblem, right? Not the Batman Returns emblem. I know some companies they'll say 1989. And then they'll have the returns emblem on an 89, but this is actually the correct bat emblem for 1989. So this is this is super nice, man. Like right, this is definitely going on display. I'm super pumped, super hyped to actually finally have this thing. And that's it, guys. That 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 really is it. That's it. So I'm gonna catch y'all next time. And I see ya. Hey, like I always say, I wanna, I wanna see if I can, no, I can't. I wanted to get it in shot, but you guys can see it pretty good from here. Be patient with yourself, be patient with your hunts. And if you're patient enough, even an egg can and will grow legs. It's been your boy, Plastic Addict. i see you next time. Collect what you love, love what you collect. Plastic Addict. Oh, shit.